Today is the day that we celebrate Earth Day, but we also celebrate the opening of this new park. It's designed to educate our community on the importance of conservation and its role in our community. Environmental elements of the park include decomposed granite parkways. We have California native plants here, and that means that these are the plants that naturally grow in California. A water-wise garden and water-retaining mulch. That means that when you water the tree, the mulch doesn't allow it to evaporate so fast. An interactive sun clock, a play garden, an interactive windmill, and power play equipment, an Ontario water history panel, as well as an outdoor educational amphitheater. The tiles displayed on the outdoor educational amphitheater were designed by students of Central Academy School. Isn't that cool? Learning is fun, and that is why we have an integrated interactive play features, including rock climbing play equipment, flower-themed hopscotch, fossil digs, and a garden playhouse and a butterfly garden. With us today, we have both the artists that have contributed magnificent pieces to this park. Artist Dan Romero created a sculpture called The Moment. It's made mostly from recycled materials. The main part of the sculpture, the tower, is made from a weathering steel, and the birds are made out of stainless steel. Ontario artist Andrea Benitez depicted images in a style that is often seen in children's storybooks and mythology for the moon bench. The Ontario City Council continues to build civic-minded developments to strengthen Ontario's neighborhoods and provide for a prosperous and well-educated community. Tell people about this park. We built them for you to use them, okay? So God bless you all. Thank you for being here today.